and we'll be friends forever. And so he walked away. With this new friend, this new promise. So, that's the way we could make friends. I hope you won't eat me. <laughs> And I really loved uh, all these performances, and the last one was very special for me to watch this uh, old uh, traditional way. And we want to give uh, a little uh, hint. <laughs> this is our symbol for our town. So, principal, would you please come? We are one struck. We don't know where we are roaming around all over the globe this morning. Such a short while for the tour around the world. Thank you, children, for that wonderful rendition. And all your parents who made this possible. And I'm here are your teacher, the wonderful teacher, who entrusted in any activity and this is the outcome of Shishoka. I think we all need a big round of applause. When we embarked upon this task of the ISA award, we had several meetings. Of course, the first one was at British Council, uh, because it's instituted by the British Council. And after the meeting, I think, uh, some of our teachers, Mr. Rao and myself, had gone to British Council. And we were wondering whether we can pull this off. Because there are, there are frameworks within which we should work. And what worried us most was embedding internationalism. Now, how are we going to get visitors here? How are we going to get specialists and experts? Because the activity part we knew we could carry on, but all the other norms that we spelled out were very difficult to meet. And there was a bit of apprehension when we had a meeting with the staff as to how to go, because we know our teachers. They really have to work to perfection, that's how we are. Then we decided we go ahead with the process for getting what the end target is, and let it take a new dimension and it did take the stream of creativity where all of them, the parents, teachers and children put their hands together and this is the culmination of your friends. Today is the culmination of the grade 5 activity that is the folk tales and I think they chose right because we know what folk tales can do to us. It's a whole lot of beliefs, a whole lot of tradition Weaving the culture, the values of different countries, and what more do children need to learn about the world and about the values and culture? And who is not interested? There's no age or time to listen to a story or reading a story. And so much knowledge has come down the ages through stories and books. And we all educators do know we have experimented. Any lesson with the background of a story or associated with the story is learned very well. And all these children are blessed and fortunate that so much learning has happened through research and exploration as they have put it. I think it's a wonderful culmination and I wish to congratulate all those people who have made this possible. And the ample support of Mrs. Vita also, the Ministers of Middle uh, School, who has also teachers and guided them and this day is possible. It was a wonderful day. Thanks once again for all your help. I was telling Kola uh, and uh, Silva uh, what they will see here is a merging of cultures. We were talking uh, in my office about languages and you saw very small doors. They were mentioning over 108 languages are country. I think you have to make many visits to sample all of that. So, Welcome you once again, any time, please, let the time. So, thank you, Gita, making this possible. Gita Ramanujan is associated with us ever uh, since the time of the inception of Katalia. Katalia has done a lot of good to our school. It's a really show, paved the way of learning values to stories. And none other can be can do it so well. Thank you very much. Thank you parents, children have been great, and thank you for your support, teachers, and uh, our distinguished
distinguished guests here today. Thank you for being with us. I hope you can take back a lot from here. And Gita, family school will be with us. Thank you very much. We've been proud to be associated with you. Thank you. Wow.